The subject enters the room and his reality splinters into two. One consciousness dies, the other spawns in a different reality, different dimension. It's based on Schrodinger's cat theory, employing an atomic compound which, when triggered by a means yet named, creates an instance of acute quantum turbulence. Is everyone still with me? Good. Uh, moving on. Can I get the next slide? The curiosity of the male mind can take you to dangerous places. For me, it started with the door and too much whiskey. Your wife is on the line. Uh, did I wake up you and Chris? No, Chris is still asleep where you should be. I'm almost done. So, it's a device that measures the spin value of photons. So, at every 10 seconds, it takes another measurement of the photons. And depending on the value, it either kills the experimenter or it puts it in a different dimension. And it all happens in my fucking closet. Can I fuck your wife in the closet? <laughs> that was the night that I went in. Stop staring at your father like that. That's not right. How's your day today, Marley? I started working on a spread for Sam Beckett Furniture. Sounds exciting. Then I came home and scraped the acid squaring off the back porch, which was somebody else's job. days of warped reality that I couldn't trust my senses. The more I went after my original life, the more I was willing to accept the anomalies I found. When nothing is how you remember it, it's like your entire life is a hallucination. I didn't know what was real, or what I was simply imagining. I kept trying. Realities got stranger and stranger. You're not eating your dinner, fuckface. Is there something wrong? I was at the end of my mind. It was curiosity that may have killed Schrodinger's cat. Kept me from my son too long, and almost drove me mad. So, uh, you wanna help me fix that closet door? We gotta put a new lock on it. What's in there? Same thing that killed your cat. Doodles got ran over by a truck. 
Come on. Come help me. But I was home now. Or close enough.